uh, I went to the bank. Do you know how at the bank they offer candy? Yeah, well. I took their offer. <laughs> Welcome to my morning routine. As you can see, the king is sleeping right now. But then, the alarm goes off. I... <laughs> Gotta shoot that thing, cause it's super loud. Doom. Then I take off my sleep mask. I check to see if the word is clear. It's clear. All right. Take that off, all good. Then I take off my hoodie. I take off my nose cancellation headphones. I take off my air. What do I put them? I, I, I put them there. Take off my AirPods. Now I'm ready to go and get ready. All right. I wake up ready because you can't ever catch me sleeping. Now this is the most important part of my day. Okay. It determines my happiness. It makes me energized. It gets me going. Watch me. This is how you start your morning with good vibes. Yeah. Okay, so last couple of days ago I was at work and this guy comes in and I'm at I'm at checkout, right? And I'm checking him out. He's with like he with his mom and he, he his mom's like push that push the phone onto the scanner. He scan it, he scans it, and he goes, beep, it scans it. And he's like, This is weird. And I'm looking at him, I was like, What's so weird about scanning your words on your phone? And then I I wanted to ask. And he was like and he said to me, he looked at me, he said to me, he was like, dude, technology got so weird. I'm like, huh? What do you mean? He's like, oh, it's been 14 years. I just got out of, out of prison in 14 years. 14 years! Oh my God. Oh, dude wasn't there when the first black president was there. Nope. He got a big ass burrito. I'm telling you, it definitely looked like somebody who has never had Chipotle. Holy fuck. To be honest, um, I was kind of afraid to ask him what he did to be in prison for 14 years. Not that I'm, you know, I'm just like, you know, I don't want to bring back bad memories, you know. Clearly, if you go to prison for 14 years, it wasn't something worth remembering, you know what I'm saying? It's not a good memory to have in your mind, re brought up every day, every day. But if I saw him again, bro, I really want to know what he did. I just didn't want to ask him, like, what if, what if it was a violent crime? You know what I'm saying? And I'm bringing that back. I ain't gonna lie. I was scared to ask him. I didn't know if he wanted to talk about it, if he didn't want to talk about it. So I was like, all right, cuz, welcome back to life. Huh, wait till you see TikTok. You're gonna be proud of the technology, how far technology has come. Okay, bye. <laughs>